So many people are now stranded in Uttarakhand and let's go across to Vishnu Shom who joins us from near Rani Khed. Vishnu, what is the situation there and what is the latest you're hearing? Well, it seems that the damage to the roads in the Almora district, in the Nainital district, and perhaps um, include, which would also impact the Bageshwar district, because they all rely very heavily on one national highway. Uh, and that national highway leads to Haldwani. Haldwani is where uh, you actually enter the mountains in this Kumau area of Uttarakhand. And this road has seen massive landslides. Uh, we should be having images on your screen of the landslides in a place called Kenchi, in a place called Garampani and Kherna. These are areas which are actually fairly close to each other. And in fact, I'm uh, stranded as, as well as a result of the landslides over here. Now, speaking to the National Disaster Relief Force, they say that it could actually take, um, they don't have an idea of how long it's going to take for these uh, landslides to be cleared and for road access to be started. Uh, this particular area, Kherna, Garampani, Kachi, it is known to be very vulnerable. There are frequent rock slides or rock falls in this particular area irrespective of whether or not there is rainfall. But the fact that uh, the, the hills were completely oversaturated would uh, have meant that this area, which is so sensitive, would be particularly vulnerable. And that's exactly been the case. So how long it's going to take, we don't know. So that's impact number one. And this is something which impacts all of the uh, the hill stations, whether it's uh, Almora or Ranikhet or other areas as well, Pitsakhet. There is a tenuous and a very tenuous and possibly dangerous road connection at this stage from Nenital down to Nenital area, but we are being told uh, from the police and others before attempting it. Uh, we are also told that in addition to the major uh, landslides which I have, dis uh, which I have uh, explained to you, there are many other landslides in this entire area. Uh, and these would also need to perhaps be cleared, but shouldn't necessarily take that much time. Uh, in addition to this, um, the big concern now is going to be fuel. Fuel pumps are uh, are out of stock. There are emergency provisions now, which are kept for emergency vehicles. So unless the road access opens up, getting fuel to going to be there are no reports of hoarding or anything like that. It's perhaps all right, uh, Vishnu Shom, they're reporting from uh, Rani Khet, near Rani Khet, where he too is stranded, as he was telling us, landslides reported on all uh, major roads leading up to the hill town and uh, rescue operations. They're continuing, but the good news is the rain, as this seems to have stopped and the worst is over for Uttarakhand.